maybe there's some um, crazy people out there who actually want to open their own assisted living facility. Can you give them a step-by-step -step guide so they don't make the same mistakes perhaps you made and make it a little easier? Because we do know there's a shortage of those kinds of all kinds of facilities, shortage of caregivers, shortage of everything. It's the caregiver tsunami, I say, that's coming. Too many uh, people from the um, baby boomer generation who are getting older and need care and not enough people to support it. What do we do? Yes. So what we do is we open good assistive living. Okay. <laughs> the key word is good, yes. <laughs> One we that I wouldn't mind good. putting my cat in. <laughs> <laughs> and, so, and so do you actually have a guide for that? You have something that can help people do that? Yes, I do. CarleneCadetFrancois.com. I have a free guide. It's a step-by-step -step on how to open an assisted living facility from scratch. Um, just oh, go on there. Go ahead. <laughs> Go on the oh, website. I just said, wow, from someone who did it. Yeah. Yes, from someone who did it. Um, I made a lot of mistakes, but it was worth it. CarleneCadetFrancois.com. Uh, just put your name in your email. It would automatically download to your email. And I always preach for good assistive living. Um, if a lot of our caregivers, they want to open assistive living. Oh, really? um, yes, I spoke to some, you know, a lot of them I come in contact with because they call me for a position. They look me online and they call me for a position. And I always ask, have you thought about opening your own? Um, one of the <laughs> biggest hurdles that they have is the fact that they don't have enough income. And I thought, perhaps, why don't you, you know, joint venture with somebody else? You know, you bring your money together and you open an assisted living and you too can work there or you can hire people to work there and you get to do things how you want to do things that's so Hopefully refreshing. the right way so refreshing to hear you say that because so many in this industry are like you know us against them i'm not going to help you because it might take away from me and uh, you know it might hurt me to help you as far as being uh, in the business in the industry but um, in order to tell uh, a caregiver that you should open a new facility, you might lose a caregiver that you could have hired and probably need, but that you have a longer vision for uh, longer term. 